The oil industry continues to master the airspace, and perhaps soon we will even see a new type of aircraft in their toolbox, an unmanned helicopter. Our film crew went to the test. This is our launch point, this is our landing. Today the new drone has to cover 53 kilometers. In a couple of minutes it is going to arrive from one of the booster pump stations already carrying oil samples. Here, at the super viscous oil treatment facility, it will be loaded with several more samples of black gold, after which the helicopter will fly to the laboratory. Prior to this, oil samples were transported daily by land transport. The purpose of the drone is to make it easier for people to work in conditions in which they cannot perform their basic duties. These are difficulties including limited visibility and some other meteorological conditions. Well, including reducing the delivery time. That is, if we take remote areas of Russia, there is difficult terrain. Where the car travels for six hours, the drone can cover the distance in 20 to 30 minutes. The helicopter is capable of lifting cargo up to 7 kilograms and reaching speeds of 108 kilometers per hour. The Belarusian made model is not afraid of either 30 degree frost or strong winds. Due to its aerodynamic and engineering design features, the helicopter can withstand wind gusts up to 15 meters per second. Vertical takeoff and landing makes it easier to operate than other drones. This unmanned aircraft system is capable of staying airborne up to two hours and covering a distance of 120 kilometers. Today, we are testing this technology. We will evaluate the results and then consider its feasibility for our processes. The flight plan is set in advance. Control is carried out from the ground control station from a laptop. The monitor displays all the current parameters of a drone, from speed to engine temperature. However, the function of this helicopter is not limited to the transportation of goods. It can carry equipment for monitoring, aerial mapping, laser scanning and gas analysis. After testing, experts will evaluate the effectiveness of a drone and decide on the extent that this technology will be adopted.